Welcome to the video on the 2005 Meridian 381 sedan, sponsored by Waterline Boats. This is Roger Drill trying to give you a verbal idea of the vessel. Now we're looking at the aft section of the vessel ordering through the trans boarding through the transom or over the side. There are built-in steps to make it easy access to either go forward or into the vessel. Here we have the staircase with grab rails to the flybridge. We'll get back to that. It's a very spacious area. Now we're looking at the main door, which is a sliding door entering the main salon. Uh, to the left, there is a uh, couch, which converts into a bed. It's a hide a bed. See if you can turn the volume. Uh, looking forward on the port side, you see the galley area, uh, stove top on the back there. There is a dinette area on the starboard side, and now looking aft, you see the electrical, electrical panel, panel there, <laughs> another <laughs> couch, and then a the television the set. Now we're looking <laughs> aft from, from the galley area. area. There is the uh, large 32-inch TV set, which goes with the vessel. Again, the hide bed couch on the uh, port side. Here's the countertop in the, in the galley. Now we're looking at the galley with the two-burner electric stove, uh, microwave built in on the cabinet, and a freezer refrigerator combination under the counter. Perfect. Yeah. I got that in a hurry. Yeah. I've gotten there, there are blinds through the arm, entire, entire vessel. vessel. Now, now we're up into the forward stateroom. Room. There's the locker on the port side, side overhead hatch, uh, oversized, uh, almost a queen size berth there. Uh, very nice upholstery surrounding it. Another uh, hanging locker on the starboard side. As we look down, you'll find underneath the end of the berth, there are three large drawers for linen storage or clothing storage while underway. Uh, here we again are looking down into the second stateroom, uh, which is kind of a crawling arrangement. Uh, I think the V-Bird or the uh, uh, forward berth is more comfortable, but this is a good large area uh, in the uh, area uh, forward on the starboard side. Uh, you can see the hanging locker there, some ventilation on the starboard side. Now we're swinging forward and we're looking into uh, the head area. Going down to the sink, shower there straight ahead. And, and back, back over to seeing the uh, uh, vacuum flush toilet, toilet and the uh, sink, and, and again, again ventilation. ventilation. Here we are going up the stairs to the flybridge. Uh, easy to move up there, lots of grab rails. As you can see, more rails on the top. Right there is the uh, helmsman seat for the main engine control. There's your controls, there's the GPS plotter and radar all in one unit. Uh, all the con electronic controls are on that panel. This is a twin-engine, 330-horsepower Cummins-powered engine with an Onan 5KW generator. Large seating area in the flybridge is very comfortable. You can put several people up there. Full enclosure uh, with zipper smiley faces, we call them, that open up for ventilation. Now we're looking aft and going down the ladder. Uh, there's also a large seating area behind the built-in uh, couch, which is in that of the U-shaped couch. You can see there's full enclosure throughout the, the flybridge. Looking down again at the seating area, cushions are in very good condition. Thank you for viewing our video on the 2005 Meridian 381. From Waterline Boats, this is Roger Drill.